don't move. I said don't move. I have a gun pointed in the back of your head, so don't try me. Drop the knife and keep looking forward. You got any other weapons? A gun? Something like that? Where's the rest of your people? How many are you? Just you? Yeah. Nice try. Think I'm gonna buy that crap? I've been around, surviving like you did. I know that there's no way anyone can make it out here with just a small knife. Not with all those walking corpses going around. Now talk. Where's your camp? How many people are there? Don't make me ask again. Still lying. Should I just end you right now and avoid trouble? That's what people are anyway. Take one step forward and turn around so I can see your face. Slowly. I'll shoot you if you try anything. And I'll be gone just as soon as your body gets served for dinner for the dead ones. Hmm. You're young. And you don't seem to be the fighting type. Wonder what you did to survive this long. See, I don't trust anyone. Now tell me what the hell you were doing here. You thought everyone would be already dead here, right? Well, I'm still here, and I'm not letting anyone near this place. This is my safe house now. But you see, now we have a problem. I can't just let you go back and tell your people where I am. They'll come here and take everything I have left. I know how it works. I've done it myself. You gotta do anything you can to survive. To keep yourself and those you care about safe. Even if it means someone else has to pay the price. Well, I'm sure as hell not going to be paying for others. Not anymore. So you see, I'm not gonna let you go. You think you can fool me? I already understood how this world works. You expect me to believe that you managed to stay healthy and fed being all by yourself, huh? You better start answering questions before I lose my patience here. What's your name? And what were you doing here? Looking for supplies, yeah. We all are. Nowadays, food and medicine are worth a person's life. Or even more. Who sent you here? Still going with the I'm all alone story, huh? Then tell me, how did you manage to survive all by yourself with just a small knife? Huh, <laughs> so you did belong to a group. But not anymore. Let's say that I believe you. What happened to that group then? Uh huh. You got attacked and barely made it out alive. And how many days has it been since then? So you've been on the road for two days all by yourself. That's what you're telling me. Damn it. You best not be lying to me. Has anyone been following you? You don't know. Well, if those attackers you talk about were the kind of people I imagine they are, then you're most likely a walking target now. Just what I needed. By coming this way, you just dragged me into whatever mess you're into. Now, get inside the house before anyone or anything sees you. I'll be right behind you, so don't do anything stupid, okay? I'm watching you. Sit there, on the couch. Now, I want to know what's going on around here. I haven't been out lately, just using this place as a safe house for a while. This group that raided your camp, do you know who they are? 
How did they look like? Any specific features that might distinguish them? No. Just some aggressive folks that could look like anyone else. Great. That's helpful. Well, if they're organized, then that means they're dangerous. And what happened to the people in your camp will happen to anyone in their path. Ah, oh, crap. I like this place. Now, thanks to you, I'm going to have to leave. Who am I? I'm just some guy that had the bad luck to survive long enough to see the world go to hell. That's who I am. <sighs> Look, we're not gonna be bodies here, okay? I've already run into too much trouble. I don't need more. <sighs> Listen, I'm not a good guy. And I don't intend to be one either. Good people died long ago. All that's left is us now. So don't expect me to keep you safe. I'll be out of here first thing in the morning. I'd advise you to do the same. If the dead don't find this house soon, the living will. And they're the ones you should worry about the most. You do know how to defend yourself, right? Judging by the blood on your clothes, you must have done some fighting. People, corpses, it's all the same to me. So I don't really care about what you had to do, who you had to kill, or why. There is just no end to violence. That's just how things are. What the hell? Already? Is this your people? Did you just lie to me? I swear I'll shoot you right now. Damn it. So you were being followed. <sighs> There's at least three of them, for what I can see. They have guns and even have radios. I know that kind of people. They don't take hostages. They just take what they want and leave a mess behind them. Bastards. If they know we're here, we're as good as dead. Listen, if you want to make it out of this alive, you better do as I say. We're fighting our way out of this one. Here's my second gun. It's way better than that rusty crap of a knife you had. Now, we gotta save ammunition, so aim only for the head, okay? And only shoot if you absolutely have to. Don't make me regret giving this to you. Shh. Be quiet. They're coming. Damn it. What a mess. And all these gunshots, the dead will be here any minute now. What? Are you mad? Is that because I gave you an empty gun? Well, I had to be sure you wouldn't shoot me in the back. You could have easily been one of them. But now I know you're not. These ugly bastards had a couple of weapons here. That will definitely be useful. Wonder how many innocents died because of them. At least now we know they won't be hurting anyone else. Well, I'll take the shotgun. They're all yours if you want to search them too. Alright, I'm leaving. Once the other members of their group find out they're missing, they'll come here looking for them. And I sure as hell not plan on staying for that party. What? You want to come with me? <sighs> Listen. I told you before. I'm not gonna be your friend, okay? 
I'm done protecting others. No, I don't care about you or anyone else. This, this right here, meant nothing. It was just for survival. I couldn't care less about you. I'm not the kind of person you hope I might be. I'm a murderer. Look around. Three more people are dead now because of me. You won't be safe around me. Whatever. I'm just gonna pack some food and take my leave before this place goes to hell. I know that going back from where you came is suicide. And that staying here means the same. So there aren't many options. But us going in the same direction does not mean we're buddies. As soon as I find a car with fuel, I'm getting the hell out of this place. Grab whatever you can and let's get moving. The dead ones will be here soon. <laughs>